So I am at the house on Temple Knolls. And just to give you a feel for the neighborhood, this is a single family home. It's kind of on a um, dead end type of a street, but the homes that are for sale here, like this duplex, one side was listed and probably is still listed for around four million. And then this house at the end of the street up here is also listed in the four million-ish range. And um, it's also in need of quite a bit of updating, but the advantage is there just aren't that many single family homes here in Steamboat, and um, we can't see where the lift is right now, but the walk would be down this street and up the road, and it's not not real far. The one from the end of the street probably has a little bit better access going through some of the ski area property. So we are headed inside. And the floor plan is really good for multifamily because it has a big master suite here on the main level. And then it has one, two ensuite bedrooms upstairs and also downstairs, extra living area and a bedroom. So there's this big open living area and dining area. You come in on tile floor and probably certainly want to take out the carpet in this place but overall it has a pretty good layout it's got some nice beams we'll go outside here in a minute and look at the view we just came in the front door by the staircase and here is a what I believe to be a gas burning fireplace it looks like somebody had a bit of a fire going in there um, and then the kitchen over here has nice views of the ski area. So we're out on the deck here, certainly big enough. They have a table for about four people, but you could probably redo that a bit. Um, ski Trail Drive is right here, and then it crosses over into the neighborhood where you can see that truck going down, and that's another one with just multi-million dollar houses that really do have ski in, ski out access. The trail right there is right away. And you can see the lift. You can see the lift line, how it comes down. And you really can't see the lift itself, but it's pretty close behind that house that we're looking at. The kitchen has these big, huge windows, really nice views. The kitchen itself is pretty non-traditional for Steamboat because it is white like I mentioned in the email and then the trim is also white. It has a, a vaulted ceiling on one side and then the beams and the lights right above us right here. And you have a big island with the cooktop, refrigerator, and then we are going to go into the master suite next which is right around the corner here, which is also accesses the garage and the laundry. So from the kitchen, this is the really large master suite. It's down a little bit. It's got a separate shower room. And then these dual sinks on both sides of the very large jetted tub. The master itself is a vaulted ceiling, really big. And the views are going to be of the ski mountain through the window here. And they have these built in cabinets. And then in the garage there is plenty of storage. There is one, two, three, four of these locked cabinets that appear to be go to go fairly far back so you could keep a lot of stuff here. And then across from the garage is the laundry room. 
So I just came downstairs and here there is plenty of storage. And then this level has one bath with separate tub and shower combo. And then a really large living area and a bedroom in the living area accesses the outside with a couple of sliders. So this is a nice space. Bedroom has access to the hot tub. These bedrooms are huge. You could put a lot of people in here. And then at the bottom of the steps, there's additional storage and the mechanical room. And it seems like there's some deferred maintenance going on. I'm not quite sure what's going on with this, but. And I'm standing at the top of the stairs with the entryway. Upstairs here is a nice bright area. Same vaulted ceilings that would look over the kitchen. Little desk area here. And then on either side of that open space are two ensuite baths. And this house has a lot of space. It's over 4,000. And then there's a large closet and owner storage that's locked in the back. There's two closets. And here is the final bedroom. And this just has a shower, standalone shower. And then for scale, you can see the size of the, looks to be a queen and a twin. So these are really big rooms. You could certainly really have a house full. So this is where you get the lift. Um, this is Thunderhead. This is the one that some people get dropped off here just so they can get up. And where the access to the house is, is that, and this is kind of where how you would do it with Karina's, where you get the little golf cart thingy and walk. But you can see the road right there and the gray house through the trees. And that's the house. And here's just a little further, once you go down around the corner, you can see the road access and then the gray house on the left-hand side. And here's the house from the road side and access up to the mountain.